everybody, Rick Needham handicapping the races from Harris Chester Harness Facility in Chester, Pennsylvania. It's Monday afternoon, December the 15th, and this is my HarnessLink.com, day at the track.com race of the day. I'm going to focus on race 5 this afternoon, folks, 1.31 p.m. Eastern Post Time. We have Trotters pacing for a, racing for a purse of $11,500. Contenders number 4 tonight, AAS number 3, Pleasant Spur. Number six, Source of Victory, and number one, Lord Darby. Number four, tonight, AAS drops in class this afternoon, has produced power run performances in each of his last five starts. Number three, Pleasant Spur, is the morning line favorite, has hit the board of each of his last five starts, winning in his fourth race back. Driver Kat Monzi and trainer Carl Cito Jr. sent him to the rolling gate today. They fit the board with 53% of nearly 150 entries harnessed as a team to date. Race 5 summary, number 4, tonight AAS tops my contenders list, which also includes number 3, Pleasant Spur, number 6, Source of Victory, and number 1, Lord Darby, 4, 3, 6, 1, and the 5th today from Harris Chester. A couple of bonus long shots for you as usual, folks. Let's go to Delaware's Dover Downs first, race 6, 4 to 1 shot, number 4, Buster B. A New Zealand bred entry qualifies as a Trackmaster Plus Power Pony. Nice overall speed for this evening's pacing test. Race at Pompano Park in Florida today as well. Race 5, number 5, Farmer Jones, a 4 to 1 shot. Qualifies as a Trackmaster Plus Power Pony. Is the speed leader in his trotting field tonight and has hit the board in power run fashion in both of his last two outings, winning in the second race back. So from Harris Chester on Monday afternoon, repeat them for the websites of HarnessLink.com and DayAtTheTrack.com, reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.